Welcome back to the channel guys. We got another product review for you guys uh, today and uh, that product is the uh, four person icicle tent and then they're also their uh, T12 uh, mini fridge. Let me turn the camera around. I don't mind the messy messy truck. It's all my work related stuff but the product today is this tent right here. This is the ice cold uh, four person tent and four season tent that they sent out to me to uh, you know do a little review take it camping which I did a few times and then also they were kind enough to send me this small t12 mini fridge 12 volt mini fridge uh, for me to take a look and try it out and see my honest review on these two products so uh, before we get started on the review let's go into the unboxing of these two products All right, guys, let's see if we make these products appear first. There it is. Well, let's uh, get this thing open up. There it is, guys. Whoa, it's looking really nice. All right, let's uh, get a closer look at these uh, two products that Ice Cold sent me. All right, guys, first impression. Wow, these are actually really nice. Uh, seems like the quality is really nice on these. This tent. Let's see if I can open it up right now. With one hand. Yeah, stuck. Ooh, cool. Instruction. Pretty simple. Something. I'm already pretty used to. And the actual tent. I'm gonna go wide angle, one second. Oh there, it's a little bit easier to work with. Okay. Yeah, pretty good build. Obviously, I'll get to uh, set it up another day. But uh, so far, man, my first impression of this tent is pretty good quality. The fabric is pretty good fabric. I like the carrying case for it. So it should be a pretty uh, cool tent. All right, let's check out the, the cooler or the mini fridge they sent to me. All right, let me get a opening tool. All right, let's see what we have here. Okay. Charging unit. Okay, so this goes into your cigarette lighter in your truck and connects to the fridge. All right, let's see the fridge itself. Oh, styrofoam box out of the way. Ooh, man, this is really nice. Okay, let me get two hand here to open up. Carry this one second. All right, guys, so my first impression, this is really nice. I like the way it is designed a lot. Uh, enough for maybe sandwiches, a couple of stuff, like a weekend camping. And I love how compact it is. I love this little carrying uh, handles on both sides. love the design, very sleek, very modern. Almost like like uh, almost same size as my printer, so which is very compact. And this tent is look like it's very good quality, so I'm looking forward to testing this out as well as this uh, fridge. So thank you, Ice Cove, for sending this out. Um, yeah, let's see about testing this two product out, guys. All right, guys, so what's my uh, honest opinion on these uh, two products, especially the tent? I gotta say, I really like this tent. Uh, when this ice school first uh, contacted me about doing a tent, and honestly, I wasn't sure because I have so many tents. I think I have three different types of tent, the backpacking tent, obviously the gazelle tent, and another like Coleman, like the tent from Walmart, so we have for five years. So when it sent out to me, I was like, oh man, am I gonna be using this tent? But uh, I actually yeah, did get a chance to use this tent and I like it. It kind of falls between like a Coleman and uh, maybe a backpacking tent. 
it's not as light as a backpacking tent. Um, so this is more definitely towards the budget friendly uh, camping tent, if you want to call it uh, something like that. So it fall between like a little bit better than a Coleman, I would say, and the quality bill and whatnot. So when we opened it up in uh, Big Bear for the first time, put it up, it took us a while, but I think uh, once we got the hang of it, because it's been so long since we do this type of state style tent, that uh, it took us a while to get it down. But once we got it down, it's like three, four minutes, we were able to get everything going. So this tent definitely, if you plan to backpack, it might be a little bit um, heavy, I believe. But uh, for the most part, um, you can use just a regular car camping, you know, not uh, you know, camping at an uh, established campground. This tent is perfect for that situation. And it's really nice, it's very budget friendly for the price and get you get, uh, what you get and everything. And what I really like about this tent is it has that um, little um, area, uh, vestibule area where you can put all your backpack. Um, or your shoes or whatever stuff you need to uh, put it out there. And we used it in the Eastern Sierra this past uh, trip and uh, it was really, really windy. And this tent was able to withstand gusts of maybe 30, 40 miles an hour. So definitely we tested it out in Big Bear, we tested it out in the Eastern Sierra and it, was, it did fine, especially in the wind. And having that little opening where we can put our dirty stuff and our um, camping related stuff before we get into the actual sleeping area was really nice to have. And uh, it's light, it's uh, super light, uh, lighter than I thought actually compared to the other tents that I had. So, and it's more compact, obviously it's super small. Um, so if you guys are looking for, you know, size and whatnot, this is actually pretty reasonably sized for the tent. But definitely, I highly recommend you guys looking for a budget friendly, maybe for car camping, uh, ice cold tent might be a good option to have. And uh, the quality and everything, the stakes, the uh, tie down, um, the carrying back is very good quality. I can never get these stake or these things back into the original pack, but I think you guys can do it. I just got lazy and I just tie everything on the outside, which is kind of nice. You can just tie it out. And have a carrying case with you like this one. So moving on to the fridge, this is actually, now this was kind of unexpected. They said they're gonna send this out and then they say, hey, you want to try this fridge out as well? I was like, yeah, why not? I just want to see how it is, a small compact. I really like this. This is definitely a game changer for a weekend warrior kind of guy. If you're by yourself or maybe with your wife or girlfriend, just one person, this is perfect for it. You can definitely fit maybe a few sandwiches, maybe a few drinks for one night, maybe two nights if you're pushing it. Uh, but definitely for one nighter, like a weekend thing, this is perfect. So we carry our regular uh, other fridge with us. It was about like uh, 47 quarts, 45 quarts or something like that. And then we carry this in the Menachi Meadow as well, for all the drinks. So we take this when we go exploring, just put a bunch of stuff that we want to eat sandwiches we made, um, drinks, a uh, few other you know, things we want to keep cool in here and then we'll go exploring and then uh, have something nice and cold to drink and the sandwich will be all nice and cold. I don't have to worry about ice and whatnot. So in the past we have the big fridge with us uh, carrying it but having this definitely was nice. So compact, super light. So I can't say enough good things about this fridge. So you guys looking for something even just picnicking uh, out on the be beach or something like that this coming summer, this might be a perfect buy uh, for that. what you guys gonna do, like a weekend, one nighter kind of thing. So definitely, definitely um, good overall tent for what it is and great mini fridge for that weekend warrior or one nighter you guys looking to explore uh, the local trail and whatnot. So, and I know that Iceco is actually the parent company of Set Power and so obviously I have my set power fridge uh, by them before so I can't say enough it's been over a year and the quality uh, live up to the name you know so it's uh, you guys looking for something a little bit more budget friendly um, not too crazy amount of uh, money spent recommend this tent and recommend this fridge for that one nighter or that weekend warrior to get your drinks all nice and cold all right, well, hope you guys like this review video. Um, yeah, I'll definitely be using these two products in the coming uh, trips. Uh, and so, yeah, keep up with us for other 
off-roading content and uh, other product review when it comes to hiking, overlanding, off-roading, camping, all that good stuff. All right, I'll catch you guys on the next one.